guys welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi my name is ariana and this is my channel you are welcome here anytime you want before i even get started with today's video please be sure to hit that subscribe button down below and then hit that notification bell next to it so you can be notified every time i upload a new video as you can tell in the title today's video is going to be a mukbang this is actually going to be my first official like mukbang video if you guys do end up liking this video then please let me know and i will gladly do more for you we're just going to see how this one goes because this is my first official mukbang so you know so without further ado let's get right into this video we're going to be eating these right here mm, these are chicken gizzards with a sauce right here i actually asked for extra sauce because they try to give you this whole thing with one sauce like Ooh! I said give me more sauce even if you have to charge it for it because there's no way there's no way and I got these wings as well because I've been craving wings and I saw them and I'm like mm, they look like they're not that good but you know it'll do and then I got a corn dog because I always get a corn dog from there and this one looks like hella burnt but it's the only one they had and I really craved it so yeah ni modo I know chicken gizzards are like weird. A lot of people don't like them, but girl, they are good to me. As long as I have sauce, because if I don't have no sauce, then they gross me out. Mm. I was going to do this video yesterday, but I couldn't because of the fact that I spent more time doing what I went to go do than I thought. Because I had to go fill out some paperwork because I'm getting a new job. And then I had to go take a drug test, which was hella far. Way farther than I expected. It was like a 40 minute drive. And I don't know how to drive far. Like, I don't know, but I don't like driving far because I'm a weenie. I didn't start driving till I was like 15. Like, I took driver's ed and stuff, but, like, I never really drove a lot until I got my car. No, wait, before I got my car, when did I start driving? I think my boyfriend would literally make me drive his truck so I could learn how to drive, but... I never wanted to learn how to drive. I don't even know how I passed driver's ed in school, like... I don't know how... My nickname in driver's ed was literally three cones like if you had driver's ed with me sophomore year then you know my nickname was three cones in that class because during the little practice area i was doing the angled parking and when i went to go reverse instead of reversing i went forward and i ran over three cones and ever since then my name was three cones So yeah, hopefully I will be starting that new job soon. Um, as soon as they get the results for the drug test, um, they're going to hit me up to let me know when I can start already. So hopefully by the end of this week, or if not next week, today is Tuesday. So we'll see what happens. I hadn't been working for a few months. That's why I've been pretty consistent with my YouTube because, you know, I haven't been working. So I've been having like hella free time to do videos and stuff. And now that I'm going to get a job, I'm like a little bit worried how that's gonna work because i still want to be consistent on my youtube but if you guys see changes in my consistency it's probably gonna be why and i really don't want to change it but i know that i'm gonna be freaking tired and stuff so i'm still gonna want to be consistent on youtube because you know this is what i like to do but i'm gonna be making that sh money but yeah guys i was literally not working for like hmm. Like, it's been, like, four months since I've worked. Um, that is weird because literally I've always worked. I'm, I wasn't used to not working, but at the same time, it was kind of nice. But I wasn't used to it because I had always been working. Even when I was in high school, I would work. Like, every summer break, I would work. Uh, winter breaks, spring breaks, I would always be working. So, and literally, the day after my last day of high school, I started working full-time. And I had always been working. And yeah so this is like the first time that i have been not working and it was kind of weird for me because you know i've always been working and 
the best part about it is that I had like time to do YouTube videos and stuff but literally I would just do like makeup tutorials and then I would take the makeup off because I wouldn't even go anywhere but yeah this is going to be my third job ever like literally the first job I was there forever and then I left to my last job which I was um receptionist at a dental office and I thought that that was going to be the job for me I thought that that was going to be the job that I was going to be at for years but honestly there was a lot of things wrong with that place I ended up leaving and yeah ever since then I had been um I have been like unemployed I guess there's a really salty Hello, salty. Anyways, today I went to the doctors because I was having some issues that I was afraid it could be really serious and I started to get worried. I'm not a person that likes going to the doctors. I don't go to the doctors for any little reason. But like this could turn into something really serious. So if I didn't go to the doctor, like I was going to be worried. Like, what does that mean? Like, what is going on? So, I went to the doctor last week, and today we had to do, like, the follow-up, but I think everything is good now, honestly. I was getting really worried and scared because someone I know had the similar thing, and it ended up getting really serious, like, really serious. I'm not going to say what it is because I don't want to put their business out there, but... He said that like if that happens to you to make sure to get checked out by the doctor because it could be really serious and my doctor said that I'm probably fine he told me what the issue was so thank God for that I love the color of this top it is so freaking pretty like it's like lilac I got it from Goodwill so a lot of people have been hitting me up asking me about like youtube and that they want to start their own youtube channel and stuff and i'm like go for it dude like what do you what is there to think about if you want to start a youtube channel go ahead and start it you don't need a fancy camera you don't need a computer for editing honestly all you need is an iphone and imovie like that's literally all you need iphone and imovie and then your own creativity your own videos about yourself that's all you need to start a channel I'm sure eventually you're going to want to have better quality. That's when you get a camera and the computer and stuff like that. But to start a channel, you do not need all that stuff. Like, I know the main problem with people is the editing, which I don't understand it because, yeah, editing takes a long time. But if you're doing what makes you happy, then it shouldn't really matter. You know what I'm saying? I spent hours editing the videos that I make. Like, literally, one of the videos that has taken me the longest to edit is the drugstore lipstick ones. And that was, like, a really short video. I think it's only, like, eight minutes long. And that one took me so long to edit. Honestly, it really did. Not only that, but I had to record it twice because the first time I was recording, I didn't like the way the video was coming out. And I ended up starting all the way over. So... I know how that feels. There's times where I don't like how the video's going and I'll just start it over. And it is what it is. Like, if you're doing what you like, it shouldn't matter how long it takes you. You know what I'm saying? If that makes sense. If editing taking too long is your excuse to not start a YouTube, then you don't really, you're not, you're not in it for the right reasons because that shouldn't matter to you. If you're doing something you like, something that makes you happy, it doesn't matter how long it takes you because you're enjoying what you're doing. There's some times where I don't like how a video came out, but I know that after editing, I'm going to like how the video comes out. And during the editing, I'm actually enjoying it. So that's how you know you're doing what you like. So you know what I'm saying? It's just my opinion, though. That's my opinion! Regardless of what kind of videos you want to make, trust me, there is videos for everyone. Trust me, there's going to be at least one person who's going to watch those types of videos that you make, regardless of what they are. Yesterday, I literally 
posted my first ever TikTok. And honestly, the TikTok that I made wasn't even for posting. I just did that video to practice, like, on TikTok. I wanted to see what it's like because I actually want to start making videos on TikTok. And then I ended up liking it. And I posted it. And I had a few people say some rude shit to me about it. And I'm like, okay, like, why does it bother you? Like... She's it's not that it's not that serious. The way I responded to one of them, I was just like, <laughs> thanks. And then they ended up changing their attitude real quick and complimenting me. I was like, what? Bro, what are you talking about, man? That was like something I used to worry about in the beginning before I even made my YouTube. I was worried about like the negativity that I would receive and so far i hadn't received any until now but it's not even on my youtube channel it's because of tiktok and it was literally one video that i made but i don't know people are just always going to be like that regardless unfortunately there's people that are so miserable with their lives and they have nothing better to do than be negative to other people who they don't even know it is what it is though like i'm not for everyone and that's fine is it weird how i eat wings like i like to pull off the the chicken and eat it rather than bite it because sometimes biting it like grosses me out like i can bite certain parts of the wing but i don't know it grosses me out i'm weird let me tell you a funny story about my doctor let me tell you so he knows that i don't have a job because we talked about it the last time i was there and then he was like all right have a good day he's like what do you even do do you just goof off i was like yeah i goof off he was like, do you play video games? I was like, yeah, I play video games. He's like, oh, what do you play? And I told him that I play Fortnite. He's like, oh, you play Fortnite? And I was like, yeah. And then he's like, oh, okay, okay. He's like, oh, can you do the floss? And I, that's when I was leaving. So we were like in the middle of the hallway because I was about to leave. And he's like, oh, can you do the floss? And I was like, no, no. No, God, please, no, no. And he was like, oh, come on, do it, come on, do it. And I literally had to do the floss in front of him. And he, like, was laughing so much, like, if, if he found it funny. And I was, like, so embarrassed in my head. Like, I was like, oh, my God, I can't believe I just did that. Mukbang videos are lit, man. All you do is eat and talk, dude. A few moments later. That was good food. Today is Tuesday, and there's a new Fortnite update today so i really really want to play fortnite i've actually had a few people who want to 1v1 me and if you want to 1v1 me go ahead and dm me on my instagram my instagram name is at big gucci ari i'll put it right here for you um go ahead and dm me on instagram what your little gamer tag is so i can add you and we can play together but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and close out today's video i hope you guys enjoyed this video it was just a little chill mukbang video honestly i enjoyed it because i was just sitting here eating and talking to you guys how much better can that get so if you guys like this video give it a huge thumbs up so i know to do more videos like this don't forget to subscribe down below and then hit that notification bell so you can be notified every time i upload a new video and i will see you in my next video bye guys